the key is to get a comb for you is to take the comb in and you lock it, right? And then you turn and pull, turn and pull. Hey, we have a cool you here. Hello, my name is Evie Johnson and thank you so much hair.com. I am Azani's Global Technical Director and I am super excited, my friends, to bring to you Mazani and also comb coils. So here's what I'm about to do. So our segment today is gonna to be simply on how to do your comb coils at home. Um, I'm super excited to share with you on how to get that done. Now, I normally wear my hair natural sometimes. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. It depends on the look and it depends on what I'm feeling. So today I'm feeling comb coils. My first step, I'm, I have to have moisture because my hair is dry and a little disclaimer, I can't quite get my fingers through as you can see. Mm, not a good look, this is not a good look, but it's okay, it's gonna be a good look at the end. So in order for me to be able to get my hands through, flat through smoothly and easily, I am going to use my Mazani Moisture Rich Shampoo. So that's gonna be my first step. I'm gonna shampoo my hair two times and then I'm gonna come back and then I'm gonna show you how to apply the conditioner. All right, we are back. This is me shampooing my hair two times with the Mazani's Moisture Rich Shampoo. And I love it because now, remember earlier, I could not take my fingers through it because it has that argan oil and the honey in it. So now I'm able to take my fingers and detangle uh, my hair as I'm moving through it, which is super important, especially hair that's natural, right? I am going to now apply my conditioner. I need moisture and protein. That's what I need in my hair, but I need an even amount of uh, moisture. So the first shampoo, I mean, I used the shampoo first, so now the conditioner I'm gonna use is the Mazzani's True Textures. Now this one is the uh, moisture, the intense moisture replenish treatment. Um, this is how much that I'm using on my hair and I'm going to emulsify it and I'm going to apply it evenly, distribute the conditioner through the hair. And remember that's the true texture, starting to get some life back in there. I feel like I need something else added to it. So the next thing I'm gonna use is our next conditioner, which is the moisture fusion line. I use the shampoo now, I'm gonna use the fusion. Um, treatment now. So this is the intense moisturizing mask that I'm going to put on here. So this is how much I have in my hair. I love, love, love this conditioner as well. And if you notice, I did not put them together in my hand. All I did was basically layer. I'm layering my products like a cake. As you can see the curls kind of popping a little bit. I'm excited. I'm excited. Um, so I'm gonna let this conditioner sit on five to 10 minutes, but I'm gonna go under the hydrator, the hydration. And that's basically a machine that pushes out steam. So the conditioner, five to 10 minutes, we'll rinse it off and we'll come back. Hydration time. So I'm under the hydration steamer. That's what I was talking to you about. I'm just infusing some natural steam from this hooded uh, machine that pushes out all the moisture. So I have both my conditioners on and then I'm gonna let this sit five to 10 minutes. Then I'm gonna rinse it off and then we're gonna do comb coils. All right, so this is me rinsing off both my conditioners. So rinsing the conditioner off with hair that has texture to it. You only rinse off 90%, leave, but like leave a little bit in there. It's okay to leave a little bit in there. So I like that because it's like, it gives the hair the moisture that it needs. I'm gonna use next, which is my all time favorite, which is the Mazzani um, 25 milk milk. And I'm going to spray that through. Now just because my sides have an undercut, I still spray that too. It needs a little love, that needs a little love. Now, I after doing the, the leave-in spray, second thing I wanna do is the Mazzani, the 25, um, Miracle Cream. I apply a little bit on in my hand, so this is how much I have. I emulsify it, put that through, even distribution. So now I put both my 25 ml Cool Milk and cream in there. I really wish you could feel how lovely my hair is feeling right now. So my next one I'm going to use is the Mazzani foam wrap. And so I use the foam wrap is because like, I just like foam in my hair. And I like to like a set look. One, two, three, four. 
voila. Remember, just because my sides are undercut, I need to put a little love on them too. So that sits on there, and now I'm gonna comb this through. So the next product I'm going to use definitely can't go anywhere without my True Textures Curl Define Pudding, right? And this here is a cream. I love cream. So this is how much I have in my hand. Emulsify it, put it through there. And this is just gonna soften on top of the foam that I just put on there. You cannot go anywhere without your True Textures Curl Enhancing Lotion. I'm gonna put a little bit in my hand. And it's just it's gonna help me define my curls. Right? So this is how much I have, and I'm gonna emulsify that in layer, and that's gonna be my last step. And now we are ready to go. I love to subsection my hair. So first thing I'm gonna do is take a wide tooth comb, and I need to subsection it so I can have control so I don't disturb my curl that I'm gonna put in. So I'm gonna clip that away. Subsection. And I can do this any way I want. I can go counterclockwise or clockwise, but the key is to get a comb for you, is to take the comb in and you lock it, right? And then you turn and pull, turn and pull. Hey, we have a coil here. So I am going to do the next one. So I am going to do this through my whole entire head. I love my coils to be medium size. So because I like a medium size, I am going to go with a medium party. So comb the hair straight up, go in, place your comb, lock it, and turn. Lock it, and turn. But now the key thing about the comb coils is that you must slide the comb as you're moving down. As you can see, there is a coil. I'm going to go through and finish a few more. But like I told you before, like I love to section the hair before doing so because it allowed me not to disturb the curl. So the other ones, the other coils that I've done. The other thing I want to mention, if you want to go different, different directions, counterclockwise, clockwise, you can. The only difference is you're just gonna have a burst of uh, different textures coming from different angles. Clearly you can see how my hair is like gliding through because I have all of those amazing products that I put on, you know, to get my hair to um, have that, that, that glycerin that I needed to actually kind of go through and slide. So guess what? Like I am gonna go into the dryer, the comb coils are finished. So depending on what texture type you have and how much density you have is going to depend on how much dryer time you have. So I'm going to go to the dryer for a hooded dryer for 45 minutes and then after the 45 minutes I'll come back and then we're going to release these comb coils. All right and now we are back. So the comb coils are done. They have been dried. So a way you can check them can be to stretch them. I'm gonna have like this thing going on. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use my favorite product. This is basically the 25 Miracle Nourishing Oil. I'm gonna take it and release the curls. So if it's one way, I'm going to counterclockwise go the opposite way. So I'm gonna simply just take them and release. And how many times do I want to pull them apart? Depends on how much curl I want to see defined. So I normally do about two to three per one. I'm going to continue to do this and I will be back in just a minute. So now that I have my final, I feel like I am looking good. My cone coils are hydrated. I am ready to go. I'm ready to get on some Zoom so everybody can see my cone coils. <laughs> I am loving my comb coils. So thank you hair.com for allowing me to come in your space and share with the world on how to do comb coils. Thank you Masani for having the best products on the market and having my hair hydrated because I could not have done this without you. And then also thank you again Evie for giving some great information and some tips. I hope this will be worked for you. Follow Masani, follow hair.com and follow Evie Johnson on Instagram. See you soon, my friends. Thank you. Bye for now.